And a man from Greensboro is helping boost the number of low cost homes that are available here. DJ Reader went to Grimsley High School and now plays for the Cincinnati Bengals. And he's working to provide more houses on the south end of Greensboro. Fox A's Tess Bargerbert talked with him about his mission to build up his community. It's a huge project, it's, but it's a big deal. This overgrown lot on Bellevue Street will soon be transformed into an affordable place to live. We just want to do as many as we can. We're starting to buy the lots and get things and plans in motion, so we're just going to keep buying them up and, you know, there's really no limit to it. It's one of three properties DJ Reader bought near Arlington Park, south of downtown Greensboro. You want to go into areas where you know that there's a need, and you want to make sure that people know that someone cares. We caught up with Reader and his mom at a creek cleanup on Burtner Street Friday. Providing affordable housing is an expansion of the work his foundation, A Son Never Forgets, is already doing. He plans to partner with developers in Habitat for Humanity. As more apartment communities decline Section 8 vouchers and assistance programs, Reader hopes to work with those tenants. With the market prices as high as it is, it's, it's you know, people. Houses went from like $700 now, and you're paying $1,400 for that. So um, we just want to make sure that people know that someone cared and you were valued. Felicia Reader raised her son with one thing in mind. It takes a village. So remember the village who sold into you and then give back. Reader hopes to build that village up one affordable home at a time. This city, you know, helped groom me and grow me. I, it's not going to feel the same. I don't get the same gratification that I, I would get somewhere else like you know so it's just I would much rather be here back home I got an opportunity and luckily be blessed to be in a position to be able to not forget about it so I want to make sure I pay attention to it Tess Bargerberg Fox 8 News and